What's going on, everybody? Fucking AMC's got me smoking. Um, how do y'all feel about Ape? How do you feel about what Lewis had to say? How do you feel about Popcorn and everything he's had to say? All the aggressive posts about Ape being such a great thing for the community. His community. Um, I'd have to say that it's good for our institution. They're going to be able to reach to that money whenever the fuck they want. Sell off, dump off, and it not even be on the radar of AMC if it does stay in place. Um, there is going to be a run-up. There's no doubt in my mind. Um, he's tried, in Popcorn being the guy, to make it seem like every single time that he's created shares, he's created run-ups. Maybe some of that's true. Maybe like that come to Jesus moment that some people have comes when there's a couple more shares created on the streets. They close out some of those shorts. Boom. It takes off a little bit. But then they can short it back down because they bought some of those shares too. So it also creates FOMO. Now Lou went and said that this is going to become a play. It's gonna become a play. A very good play. If you're smart about it. I always was playing it like a really good play. I've been loading my money into this play every single week for the past almost two years now. <laughs> um, think about that. I haven't been able to touch shit. I, uh, watching that shit pile up. And at this point, I'm kind of excited that there's going to be some sort of run-up that I can take advantage of um, and get the fuck out of this play. There's so much in the stock market. And like I talked about in previous videos, compounding interest is, like Ben Franklin said, it's one of the wonders of the world. And uh, that's really true. There's no faster way to grow your money than to compound it. Let's just say you pick up 700% on this play and you take that money and you roll into another play after taxes, whatever. Let's just say it turns into 350%, all right? Well, you take that money and you turn it into another play and you turn 100%. Well, that play right there is now the equivalent to 1,400%. It's simple. And this plays out there. And then they're shorting AMC into the fucking ground. I don't know if that's actually an option. But, uh... <laughs> I'm not a fan of what Popcorn had to say. Um... Yeah, this is dilution at its furthest extent. This is not here to reward us. It's not. It's to reward himself, his company, be able to pay off debt and a bunch of other shit that we fund. Like, oh, and now my got a nice run up dump this off oh we got all the money to pay off all our debts what do we give a fuck about their debts like I tweeted on Adam Marin's shit um I said are you here for the short squeeze you know no response obviously he doesn't acknowledge it none of the run up was because of a short squeeze in his opinion <laughs> How could there be a short squeeze if he dumped all the shares and there were shares in the street? Um, I still got my money in the play right now. I'm going to be looking for a way out of this fucking play. Uh, for those people that are out here saying, oh, um, you're just going to follow along with whatever Lou says. Sorry, it's the only thing that fucking makes sense. Um, I know I'm going to have my fair share of haters. Or Oh, you just listen to uh, Lou Blindly. Fuck you, I listen to Blue, uh, Lou Blindly. I listen to him and I think about what he has to say, and a lot of it fucking makes sense, so. I'm bound to make a lot of money off this play anyway. From what I can see, it, it probably will run up a couple hundred bucks between AMC and Ape. Maybe AMC runs up to 60, 70 bucks, and then they stock it right there again. But. You know, um, AMC might run up 200 bucks. Bang, you have a nice play. I have a very nice play at that point. 
So, teach his own. Maybe it's not the fairy tale world we were all looking for. But if you watch just what happened with uh, Ryan Cohen or whatever his name is with Bed Bath and Beyond, the motherfucker dumped all those shares and that thing's right back in the shitter, right? Oh, this is gonna feel nice to be out of this play. I'm gonna get into a normal fucking play. Be able to make some money, hit it, be out. Be able to enjoy some of my money. But um, I'm going to keep talking to y'all. Don't be upset. Don't be. Be mad as fuck, but don't be upset. You still got shit that you can get done. But be smart, protect your investment. That's the best advice I've got.